Thank you so much. Thank you to the American Theatre. <laughs> this to anybody out there trying to write an original musical from scratch. some pretty amazing people in our business that would help you do it, whether you're writing it or directing it. But there are producers like David Stone, who's here this evening, <laughs> who I love very much, and who has the vision and the patience and the trust in the people he works with to be in something on a journey for many, many years and know that if he trusts the artist he's working with, that it will come to fruition and it will be a beautiful thing, but he knows how to trust that creative process. So I love you, David! <laughs> and I want to thank Michael Bright, he's not here tonight, but my director. Is this getting old? Can I keep going? Yes! Woo! It feels good up here. <laughs> Michael Bright for giving my first job in rent. So. I want to thank him for just making me somewhat good. <laughs> and um, I want to thank Tom Kitt and Brian York, who wrote with them, <laughs> for letting me be in their sacred space and watch them create and allow me to be a partner in that with them. There's nothing, there's no honor. It's just the greatest honor. I want to thank um, Joby, my dresser. <laughs> <laughs> She's never let me go on stage with my tits hanging out before. <laughs> I knew it was my fault, I was rushing. I was rushing, I know, I'm sorry. Joey and JT who does my hair. And um, I want to thank my manager and my agents. <laughs> Heather and Bonnie and Bert. And, and I'm getting there, I'm getting there. I don't play the music yet. And. Um, and I want to thank uh, my mom and dad are here today. I just want to say I love you, mom and dad. And I want to thank my little boy, Walker, for letting his mom go off to work and, and uh, have to make a choice and find balance between being a mom and um, a professional person in this world. And um, especially tonight because uh, there's a lot of you here. I really wanted to thank my cast from it then. Uh, this has been a wonderful year for me, but I have gone through a couple things, and if I didn't have all of them, uh, I don't know what I'd do. They're truly one, every one of them is one is a truly close friend, and um, they're supremely talented. And um, so I just want to say thank you to all of them. And um, because it's a time for transition, like I said in the beginning, it's a, it's there's new beginnings, you know. And if that's all about having the courage to take your life and start over and uh, and make a choice, and it may not always work out the right way, or you may not see why it's working out a certain way, but eventually things come into they find clarity and. Uh, you realize that you can't regret anything because every experience you have is leading you on to be open for the next opportunity. Whether you believe in God or you don't, or fate or choice, you can't deny the fact that all the experiences we have prepare us for something big that's coming or the subtle little things. So anyway, I uh, just want to thank all you so much. <laughs> 